Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I was thinking of certain things to do and what video to do and I've lately been doing um, an orange lip. So that's kind of my premise and that is the spring lipstick color which is awesome because I love orange corals. Uh, it's not for everybody. I know a lot of people are kind of like disappointed by that but it's a really really great summer color. So I am going to show you a few products that range from like super orange to a little bit more neutral natural looking coral colors and I have a array of drugstore colors even all the way to high end products and a mixture of glosses, lip tints, and lipsticks. So that's what I'll be showing you today. So I hope you guys enjoy it. I will get through as many as I can. There are so many different colors to choose from and so many different tones. These are just my favorites and the ones that I normally go to the most when I'm doing a look or you know just want that pop of color on my lip if I want to do a neutral eye. Most of the time I do do a colorful eye plus my lip but I find that the corals work really nice. So these are just some of them and most of the ones that I chose can go for almost any skin tone so it's not really limited to just my skin tone which is super fair so I hope you guys enjoy the video okay so instead of going from like drugstore all the way to high-end or glosses over lipsticks I'm gonna go more of a color array that I chose so it's gonna be like kind of just mixed in there now my first one is from a lipstick queen I love this color um, it is Saint Coral it is a super awesome color and it's a tint. It's a really nice deep coral. It could almost pull off as a nude color. Now, this looks great on almost any type of eye color. It's not too dark, it's just enough. And again, it's a tint, so it's not super opaque. It's just a really nice natural coral color that can really work for anyone. My next one, oh my gosh, I was obsessed with this. I was like, waiting and waiting for a few weeks at Sephora for them to like get this color back in stock and they didn't have it. Um, this is Melon Drama and it's by Smashbox. This one's a lot more of a peachy tone and it's a little bit more opaque. It's a really really nice pretty coral color. That's actually what I have on my lips right now. It looks a little bit more orange on camera than it does um, in real life but it is really really pretty and has more of a peachy tone opposed to more of a deep um, redder tone if you want to say when it comes to the coral colors. Okay so kind of going more into that deepy color. Now this is getting a little bit more pinky tone opposed to deeper coral but again it could still work. This is by NYX. This is 583A Hot Hot Melon. Hot Melon. <laughs> Um, it's a very opaque. They are super buttery. They're not the butter lipsticks by NYX, but this color is definitely going to be that awesome summer poppin' color of like coral. It's definitely not too orange. It's more on the pinkier side, um, but it's super gorgeous. Now getting more on the oranger side, this is by MAC and this is Saigon Summer. Super awesome color. Now it is a cream sheen. So it's not going to go on super opaque, but you could definitely build it up. This is more towards your orange or colors. Um, really, really pretty. This is like the perfect tropical color. Um, all looks really beautiful with like blue, um, cooler tone eyeshadows. Just because it makes that orange pop. And this one's, it's not for everybody, but I definitely think that it's, it's a good color to have in your collection. Now to go more on that oranger side but get a bit deeper, this is also by NYX. This is 507. Again, I'm not 100% sure on the name since I took the caps off. Um, I think this one is called NYX. And it definitely has an iridescentness to it, which is really pretty. Now this one is more of an orange with those gold undertones of the iridescentness. It goes on really beautiful. This, because the lip has so much going on with the dimensions of the colors, I think would be best more worn with a subtle eye. Um, but it's definitely a really pretty one. And again, it's the same make. Uh, they're so buttery and they do go on pretty opaque. And now getting more into the orange colors, like straight up orange. Again, I have my NYX. I just love NYX. Like, I, how can you not? 
and this is the one from the Butter Collection. This one is Hot Tamale. I love that. It's such a fun name. These almost look like red. Like, if you wore a red liner underneath, it would probably pull off as a bright, bright red. It is just a hot orange. It's a hot tamale. Um, very, very, very bright, but super pretty. Um, again, you gotta have that confidence to, to definitely wear it, but it's a really, really good one. And again, the quality is amazing. I love the butter lipsticks. And one of my all-time favorites, I actually did this in a um, previous video, I think it was like bright lips or color colorful lips for everyone, three different ones, and this is by Makeup Forever, this is in Rouge Artist Intense 40, super deep orange, it kind of reminds me of the butter one, um, except the butter one had a bit more of a warmer tone, This or a cooler tone of like pink this one definitely is like hot hot orange and it lasts forever again makeup forever has those awesome colors this one is like definitely in there now most of these are all pretty opaque so I know I said I wasn't gonna like separate the lipsticks and glasses but it just happened so um, for my lipstick and glasses I only have well I only have three lip glosses and I guess I'll kind of go well I got two lip glosses and one like lip tint. All right, <laughs> this one is by Tarte. It is called Glisten. It definitely has those sparkles in it, but it is super pretty. I'll zoom above the lipsticks, and it is more of a tint, so it's a little bit more subtle. This has gold flecks in it, so it's really, really pretty. Um, and again, it's more on the nude side. You know, it has that coral, but it's definitely one of those that can be, you know, dressed up or dressed down. So that's what's kind of nice about it. The next one I have is another Smashbox. And this one is called, this is their Limitless Longwear Lip Gloss. And it is called Bondless. I'm pretty sure, I don't know how many, but I've had this in quite a few videos. Uh, I love this color. This color is so gorgeous again this is more of like a tinted color super pretty and that perfect very pale light coral not too much and last but not least I have uh, the last lip gloss and this is by NARS this is called something follies I will look it up for you because I can't read it more of a pinky coral opposed to that orange coral this one is gorgeous because you can, it goes on like a pretty opaque gloss, but you can do it where it's super, super, just like a tint, super natural, um, super minimal, or again, you could really dress it up and keep adding layers to make it deeper. And that is all the colors I have to show you. I hope you enjoyed it and let me know your thoughts on what color was maybe your favorite or if you have a favorite color that I didn't show or have any questions about what colors to try, let me know. Again, this is going to be the summer color for lips and if you're kind of nervous about going forward with the corals or the orange don't be because I mean it's such a really awesome summer color it's so like refreshing and lively and I'm excited for it opposed to you know doing like the typical nude lip this is just the perfect amount and remember you don't have to go super super orange or super super natural there's so many different type of corals out there just like the pink ones I showed you please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already I will see you in my next video bye